Oh. Hey, they're coming too. Ugh. Come on, buddy. It ain't my job to wake you up, you know? What time is that? Time to get out of bed. Ow, my head. Oh, my head. Whoa, easy there. Move too quickly after being out for that long and you're liable to pull a muscle. How long exactly? Well, I want to say about five days. I've been out how long? And you'd have been out a lot longer if not for the best doctor on this ship. Dr. Lumen, looks like the old sleepyhead is making their way around. Zero, you're awake. I think I am, yeah. I'm glad to see everything is in order. Dr. Lumen is amazing at his craft. Without him, I don't know if you would have made it. I just do what I can. Duckington, will you be so kind as to inform the captain about Zero's recovery? I've been helping you in an awful lot lately, you know. But for Zero, it's pretty hard to refuse. Leave it to me. How are you feeling? Like I got hit by a truck. It might be some of the pain medication, too. So be careful not to overdo it. Have I really been asleep for five days? Yeah. At one point, we weren't sure if you were going to snap out of it. Even the captain was... The captain! Oh, I gotta tell him about everything we saw. <coughs> ah! Harumph! Oh, captain! Jeez, I'm so sorry. Zero, I see you were nearing a full recovery. Thank goodness. Captain, Domo was amazing and I can't wait to tell you all about it. All about the people and what we found, and... At ease. Reckon Dr. Lumen have filled me in on all the details while you were asleep. Oh, I guess that saves me some trouble, huh? I do not recall saying that is the case, Zero. Quite the contrary, I would like to hear your account of the mission firsthand. However, however, I regretfully must call on your service again immediately. I need a free of you to report to the Garden Dome as soon as you are prepared. I shall meet you there. Oh, well, you can count on me, Guidance. Captain Guidance. Right. You've been barely up for two minutes and the captain is already putting you back to work. Why well, I ought to. Even I must object to the captain from a medical standpoint. But I'm sure it will only be worse if we don't report to the Garden Dome before long. Hmph. Some great leader. Well, I could teach him a thing or two about leading now that I... Rekka, it's fine. It beats being stuck in that bed. I'll make an executive decision here and recommend getting a good walk in before we see the captain. That boy in the forest. Was that a vision? Also, now that I have the Orb of Destiny, what exactly does that do for me? Will that change her skills or something? Don't think so. She looks the same as ever. Will you be hanging out again, Doctor? Something came up. Would you mind watching the clinic while I'm away? Of course. Maybe someone will break an arm and I'll, f I'll finally have something to do. Just make sure it's not one of, uh, not of your own volition. Oh, I'd never think of such a thing, Doctor. Maybe. <laughs> Back in my old spot again. I guess the adventures were fun while they lasted. But I can digress. What's going on in the journal today? Actually missed a chest here. Fortunately, I can now skip encounters for free because I already beat the dungeon. The enemies here recognize my superiority. Tried it. Oh, that would have helped with my DPS. Oh well. At least I don't have to buy it later. I gotta admit that orange guy might be a huge lot enough, but at least he can get the customers excited. I guess that's what this place needs. New accessories, latest wares. The plus versions of the rings, huh? Water ban, earth ban, hmm. Oh, quick ring plus. Do you know what? That when you... Ahem, that when you use... Uh, oh, come on, I already knew that. You already told me that earlier. You have new stuff too, right? Oh, Zero. Well, I didn't think I'd see you back in action so soon. Yep, here I am. Do you not think I was going to make it? What? No, no, no. Of course I was rooting for you. I mean, you're my only customer lately, so... I'm happy to be here. Well, good. What can I get you?
Oh man, I was so jealous that you all got to go down and see Soma up close. When we get, find the rest of it, can I come too? <laughs> need to turn that schematic. Looks like you found some of those toy schematics. Yippee doo da. Give me a sec here. Well, what do you know? Those schematics work like a charm. Check them out. Kick me sign. Aggro. Hmm. I wonder if Fortune Teller has anything new to say. The Cosmic Core. Nothing new. Oh hey, while you were gone, I made a mean lasagna out of that cookbook. It was so good I didn't see the captain for eight whole hours after he tried some. He must have really been savoring it. I think I'll be passing on it then. Gotta leave enough for everyone else. Wowzer, you slept for five whole days. I think that's a new record. You've been keeping track? It's just one of my many lucrative hobbies. Looking for the garden dome, this is definitely, this is definitely the wrong floor. But I appreciate you coming all the way here to see me. Hmm. Oh, they originally the box of doll was placed here by mistake because of a glitch, but I guess they removed it retroactively somehow. Weird. Well, I wonder, I wonder if I'm sh have enough DPS for it. I'm at level 12 and I have all the upgraded weapons. Happy to see you back in action, Zero. I know it's tough right now, but you can do it. I believe in you. Thank you. I've never known a calculator be to be so wholesome. Calculator? Well, I know, my friend. I'm a clout -culator. It's all about telling people what they want to hear. So if you would be so kind as to hit that little heart-shaped button, pass. He's in the Garden Dome, but what about here? Oh, you're managing it. The captain said he'd be waiting for you in the Garden Dome, but I can get you down to the jungle if you need me to, I guess. Ramble Ruins, that's what it's called. Hmm. I saw it all from the monitor. There were so many trees in that jungle. Oh, but I bet none of them could talk like I can. That must have been a disappointment. It does my heart good to see people frequenting the library. We always love to see you here. There's a new book! Did we get any new books since your last visit? Well, that's what, that one on the table looks like it wasn't there before. It's not very good. Gamer tips for bad gamers. You! Do you want to read it? Yes. Advanced combat tips. Do you know that some support skills are mutually exclusive? For example, you might think you can give someone both Conjure Fire and Conjure Wind. But only one conjure ability can be in effect at a time. The second will cancel out the first. If you're not sure, look for the uh, uh, sword. Okay, I think I heard that before. This also implies infusion abilities. For example, infuse poison and infuse dazzle cannot be used at the same time. We have infuse abilities? These abilities are marked with the magic exclamation symbol to denote that they are mutually exclusive. That said, there's nothing stopping you from using other kinds of support abilities in conjunction with these, is there? Turn of Spirit abilities may also benefit from support skills as well. Try them out. Hmm. I wonder if the captain will give us a new ability. I may want to check on that before trying the dummies. What the? What's the situation in here? Well, sir, you still haven't gotten any more aggressive since you left. I thought I'd have a hard time fixing up the bridges and windows, but... They're, they don't seem all that keen on attacking people. That's strange. How peculiar. Wait, aren't those the monsters that... Absolution! What? Shadow Spawn appeared, but we do have to fight them after all. Seriously? That's a lot. That thing again? Are you serious? We're are we gonna refight this thing every time we clear a world? Okay, I'm, I'm gonna I think I'm gonna skedaddle. At least I can just spam lightning. No creatures of darkness will be overrunning this ship on my watch. Look ready. We'll need to clear them out before more arrive. Try 
Should I just go for the main boss, or... Or should I fight the minions first? The mysterious enemy seems to be preoccupied. Okay, so... Guidance should be strong enough to handle this on his own. Everyone else should just try to fight these things. Looks aggressively. I don't like the look you're giving us. Creature sure is fixated on zero. You better leave or I'll have to ask you nicely. Again, nicely. No, not nice. What? It's a different one. Dodging normal attacks, huh? The creature is muttering a strange incantation. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no. Creature hisses at Zero and their friends. No hissing when I'm on duty. Oh, it's a boss type. Hmm. Magic break. Power break. Punch or bolt. Yourself. Rush. Punch or bolt. It's everything except for the one uh, Guidance was fighting. Yeah! If you think you can waltz around my ship, we should go help the captain. Is he gonna show up as a guest character or something? Maybe he'll give us encouraging buffs? Same mob as before. Hmm. Magic break, rush, conjure bolt. Yourself. There. Is that the last of them? I hope so. I sure hope so. Excellent work. Those creatures had appeared here in the Garden Dome just a short time ago. They had not been causing a problem until now, but if that's the case, then why did they only become aggressive when they saw, uh, saw Zero? 
Zero. Come on, I don't think it was you. Maybe it was... No, Rekka, I felt it. It was the same feeling of anger. Just this absolutely terrible anger from when... Zero, what are you talking about? What anger? I too have more questions than answers at the moment. However, you free up prove, uh, proven yourself... Uh, proven most valuable in securing the safety of our ship once again. And I believe that th 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 that is what is important at the moment. We can worry about such matters later. After all, they could be mere coincidences. You know something, don't you? Zero, please come with me to the bridge. I would like to hear your account of what transpired on Soma. And yeah, I think that's everything. There was just so much to Soma. It's such a vibrant and lively place. And yet we do not know of a way to bring it all back together. At least not with what we know of it now. Captain. What is absolution? Where do you hear such a thing? I heard it, right before I fell unconscious in the temple. And then those shadows attacked me in the Garden Dome. And when those sh sh shadows attacked me in the Garden Dome, those shadows are they... How are they associated with absolution? I'm pretty sure they appeared before, right? I see. Throughout the history of Soma, we know of a great evil that has brought havoc to our world. This evil has had many names. Some would call it ruin, destruction, or others. But the most con consistent name within history has been absolution. It was a force so great that both kings and beings from beyond lusted for its power. Beings from beyond? What I is this beyond, exactly? Is that where form dissonance come from? Those who had attained absolution's power wished to bring the end of days. 100 years ago, the fate of Soma would be decided. It was none other than the two heroes who put an end to absolution once and for all. Or did they? No one has seen or heard from it since. So why am I hearing that the name? Is it possible that Absolution still lived on inside heart and soul somehow? Since they were meant to be Absolution's vessels? What does it mean? I'm afraid I don't know. But I do believe this may be of importance to us. That's the orb that Rekka found in the temple. I've been studying it since your return. It has quite a fascinating amount of power. Perhaps even enough to restore Soma. At least I believe it can eventually if more orbs like this one can be found. I'll just alternate when picking them up, but even then, will I be able to... Uh, what if there's only three of them? That means I wouldn't be able to get a bal perfect balance. If there's four of them, then I could get perfect balance, as everything should be. It's no wonder that an artifact like this would be kept so deep in the Sun King's temple. And zero. Yes, Captain? I'm not slashing or log gagging or anything, am I? You did an excellent job. Your leadership and bravery led to a very successful expedition. Next to you, we may be one step closer to restoring our homeworld. Every spirit aboard this ship has a purpose, and I believe that you will find yours before long. That is our mission as spirits, after all. The citizens of Soma aboard the ship are counting on you. They are? Of course they are. And if we are to continue helping them, we must restore Soma for the benefit of everyone. I hope we will find some more, we'll fi find more regions of Soma before long. And when the time comes, I'll be counting on you once again. In the meantime, will you be so kind as to return this orb to Rekka? That is all for now. Dismissed. If Absolution was defeated 100 years ago, what caused someone to be destroyed again? Am I, what am I hearing? And why did Absolution take the form of a giant eye this time? Make sure to deliver that orb back to Rekka. In the meantime, we'll begin planning our next course of action. Where is Rekka? It took 20 years to find that part of Soma. How long until we find the next part? Hopefully not another 20 years. Whenever we find the next world, I hope it has even more trees. I'm going to be the frontrunner for the Most Friends Man on Soma Award. That was quite a commotion down there. That's the kind of excitement I love to see around here. What? No. I mean, someone could have died. All the more reason for you to go for it. Do you have any sense of irrationality, or do you just keep telling people what they want to hear? It wasn't terribly eventful here while you were out, but Dr. Lumen is back in the clinic if you need to see him. Good of you to stop by, Zero. How are you holding up? Oh, well, I'm doing alright. I just came back from the bridge. Well, I gotta skip out and listening to that bragger for a change. 
always on about his spirit's purpose and all that. I mean, what does he know about purpose? I don't know what you mean. Every spirit on someone is supposed to have a purpose. I think so, anyway. Well, we could always use some more sets of hands. Whether it be an acorn, a strange robot man, or a... Oh, me? I'm a spirit. So it's my job to help you. A spirit, huh? Can't say I've heard of anything like that before. Dr. Lumen, you lived on Soma when it was still whole, didn't you? Not for long. I was about eight years old when the catastrophe happened. Do you remember what the spirits on Soma were like? What kinds of purposes do they have? I don't remember. In fact, I had actually never met any spirits until I came aboard the Virtue. I only ever heard about spirits in passing from my father. But I had never actually seen any. I always assumed that spirits just lived elsewhere on Soma. But it could have been just another lie of his. Another lie? Let's just say that if not for him, I wouldn't be the doctor who went and saved your life. And with that, consider this conversation over. Sorry. Fine, Zero. Just... Remember to always look after yourself first and foremost. Also, I see you have that artifact we found. Have you talked to Rekka yet? She's usually in the Garden Dome at this time of day. Hmm. What was all that commotion upstairs? Why does exciting stuff happen around here when I'm not paying attention? Where's the rock NPC? Back in my old spot again. Okay, that's the same dialogue, actually. Hey, uh, I'm trying to keep as straight of a face as I can right now so I don't hurt this guy's feelings. I feel sick to my stomach. Oh, man. Good news. I had plenty of leftover lasagna, so feel free to give it a try. I hope you'll support my first great step towards my culinary dream. I can't say this cuisine is ex exactly salvageable. Please do yourself a favor and say you're full if he asks you to try it. Hmm. I heard, I heard the, coast, the coast is clear, but I'd rather not go back into the Garden Dome anytime soon. Thank you very much. But if you're looking for Rekka, I did see her heading there not long ago. I wonder if giving her the orb will cause her to ch to change or s just like heart and soul did. Hmm. Oh, hey, Zero. Finished talking with the captain? I was just watching the stars. This is one of the best places aboard a virtue where you can stare into the vast wonders of space. But for the first time in my life, I got I got to see Soma. I got to walk on real grass in the real jungle. I never experienced that before. I was born in the ship, and this is all I've ever known. Hmm. I guess it's not all that different for me either. I've only ever known this ship before now. I don't know when I was born, but it must have been around the time the ship the disaster happened. Maybe you're just too young to remember Soma. Dr. Lumen was at least a bit older by the time the Virtue set sail. But there were still some big firsts for the both of us. All those adventures, and Big choices, uh, choices about the future. I guess going to Soma was more than I bargained for. But, you know, I don't regret the choice that I made. I guess the thing that worried me the most is ending up, like, well, the captain. Maybe his leadership works for a very serious mission like ours, but for everyday things? Absolutely not. I think I've learned what kind of leader I don't want to be. And I want to use that knowledge to help build a better Soma. Would this dialogue be the same if I pick the other option? The freedom option? When this is all over, I'm hoping to be just as grave an elder as my grandfather. And then some. My grandfather was a great elder. His legacy spans several generations of Soma, or so I understand. I wonder what he was like. Hmm. So he actually remembers about the Sun King's past? I think he must have been a very wise and understanding elder. The kind of person who would help anyone. Hmm. I bet it was just like you. I mean, you're always helping me and everyone else around the ship. Yeah. And I'm going to continue to help put Soma back together no matter what. Yeah. You and me both. Oh, and the captain wanted me to deliver this book back to you. Orb of Destiny. Oh, it's the artifact we found in the temple. I'll tell you, when I look at this thing, all I can think about is all the stress those two guys down there caused us. 
Well, I think about all the adventures we had down there. I think it's a great keepsake. Well, thanks for talking with me, Zero. I hope it won't be too long before we can all go on another adventure together. Even if it means dragging Dr. Lewin with us by the hair. Well, it's been a long day, hasn't it? Not much to do but get some good old shut-eye. So make sure you get some rest downstairs in your room. Hmm, so I guess I won't be able to bring everyone to the training dummies, even though we leveled up a bit. And probably stand a decent chance of getting that threshold. She's still pointing that way. What a day. If there are any more of those orbs out there like the captain said. I wonder, how do we know where to look? Maybe there's that's tomorrow's question. Feeling any better? Yeah, just not sure where to go next. Oh, that's a tough one. But... But what? Maybe I can lend a hand. I did say it would help, didn't I? Will you appear in the real world? Hmm. Oh, that looks like... Zero. This is the captain. Report to the bridge on the double. You all no doubt heard that. It seems our next objective is already in sight. Take a look. An amusement park? That must be another part of Soma. Oh, it looks like a, an amusement park. I've always wanted to go to one. I can't wait to go on all the rides. And I'm gonna eat a whole bunch of snacks. And I'm gonna pass. There, looks like there's an upside down city on it too. Oh, come on you big grump. Haven't you ever wanted to go to an amusement park? Yeah, where's your sense of fun, Dr. Lumen? I'd really rather let you two handle this one. I'm afraid I'll need you to accompany them once again, Doctor. While I have faith in Zero and Rekka's abilities to perform recon, I would allow no fewer than three sets of eyes for the job. I hope you will understand that you are the only one I can depend on to help them. Hmm. I also believe you should take this. It may prove useful in your exploration. Amp Charge? Yes, good thing I learned that first before trying the dummy. Speak with me when you're ready to begin the mission. Don't expect me to be happy or cooperative about it. Let's get going. The heck is an amp charge? Consumes the user's magic amp to gain buffs. Hmm, I can actually stack magic amp twice, huh? Does everyone have the same one? Yeah, it's always attack up first. Dang, I should have double stacked my magic amp. That would have resulted in more DPS. That would have probably made the, that previous boss battle a bit shorter. Okay, I realized it was actually level 20 dummy and not 15. That means it might be too strong for me right now. I still want to do some practice with Magic Amp. Let's see if I can stack it, t really stack it twice. I'm on Endless Mode right now, so there's no time limit. Yes, now I have double Magic Amp. Change my roll to power. Gale most, 20. That, okay, that's a lot. That's a lot of MP. I can only do cast like three spells with this, but is it worth it? I may be better off just using weaker spells in succession just to save MP. Hmm. Let's try Magic Amp on Rekka. 120. Hmm. I guess that could help, but... I would need a lot of magic shards. 230% mind. Compared to 160 mind for Blaze Most. Is it worth the sheer MP difference? Hmm. 
Yep, charge. That takes up an entire turn, though. So it could take a while to even set up an attack or magic buff on your character like that. You have to cast magic amp so many times just to get to, just to get them fully stacked. But would it be worth it? Yeah, let's actually use amp charge right now. And then just... Magic amp and magic amp. Yes, can, how many magic amps can I stack? Let's see how much it does now. Last time it did 120 or so. Hmm. One sixty. That's forty damage more. Not bad. Okay, let's just escape for now. That was a good bit of pr practice of mechanics. Doctor Lumen, I'll keep an eye on things as always. I'll uh, reorgan reorganize all the medical records. Now that General and Sergeant have stopped arguing about this artifact, everyone packed up and left. Me? I'm the technically a defector, but there's no one around to know this, so... Everyone moved on since the war is over. I think the Sergeant said he was going bowling. I'm not very good at it, so I stayed behind. Leaving the camp? No, nah, it means I get the TV room all to myself. I don't see any trees on that new continent at all. Man, it's lonely being the only tree up here. Going down there again? Guess I'll try to encourage you from up here, I guess. There is no orb to be found, I'm counting on you to find it. Don't let us down. Area select. Land the unknown world, yes. An upside down city and a carnival. Quite an interesting turn this has taken. If Alpha's suspicions are correct, then... I believe we will continue this experiment. Huh? A top hat? Is that the orange guy? Ah, oh, good day to you. I suspect it is my turn to take center stage. It is with your assistance that we can awaken Zero. Well, I know just what to do. You can just leave that to me. Just remember, I need them alive. Well, that's the one thing I can't promise, oh ho. No, maybe it's a puppeteer? I thought he... I thought he turned legit. Hmm. <laughs> you can end your life at any time. I hope you haven't forgotten that. I've only given you a second chance because we need zero. You're a risk taker. I like that, Professor. Professor? For your sake, I hope you don't disappoint me. I feel like every new boss is supposed to remind us of an old one. The last one looked like Dissonance, and this one looks and, and kind of acts a bit like the Puppeteer. Park Entrance. Oh, are you here to visit the park too? I'm waiting for my friend to arrive, but I can't wait to get in. Try to have enough fun for the two of us in the meantime. Tickets. Obtain park ticket. Was I... Oh, it's Lampland. Well, I've heard all about this place. I can't wait to try its world-famous light shakes. Made of 74% less glass after that one lawsuit. 74? I'm going to play every game and win a plush lamp. Without any of the copper wires. Welcome, friends. It's a beautiful day in the park. Zero presents the park ticket to the employee, even though I came in from the back. Oh, this is... Well, it's not an admission ticket, but admission is, fr admission is free today anyway. Come on in. So what's the point of ticket, then? 
Someone might be collecting these. Oh, I see. If I collect all of them, I might be able to turn them in for something. Not much else I can do here. This fence prevents me from getting to the parking lot. No rub housing video games, bad opinions. Can these guys talk? No, it's just a mascot. Hmm. Oh, I'm so excited. Look over there. Larry, Lampy Larry. Where is a good time to find Lampy Larry? Can't be too far behind. Wow, this park has its own mascot. I can't wait to meet him. Well, slap me silly and call me a flashlight. It looks like we have some very special visitors today. <laughs> Whatever the other theme parks you've heard about, leave them in the past. Come, on, uh, come in and have a glowingly good time. Watch your hands and your pockets, and leave your sense of awareness at the entrance. Welcome to the Lampland. With yours truly, Lampy Larry. So, where are we up? Here, where are we here for today? Come to enjoy the sights? Because let me tell you, we've got plenty of those. Yeah, I, uh, I, I want to go on the rides. Hmm, Lumen is looking away. Don't tell me. He's related to Lampy Larry somehow. Is Lampy Larry his father or something? I've never been to a, an amusement park before. I'm glad to see the two of you are looking to have such a good time. I haven't heard an answer from you yet. We are just looking for something to make Soma whole again. That is all. Oh, well that's not quite the answer I was expecting from you. Do you really think i just let you off with a smile and howdy-do? After what your family did to me? What? So, uh, I thought you were going to be his father, but no, this is something else. What is he? Look at you, waltzing on in here. The big man. Who left me here to run this place all by myself. You know that's not how it happened. No one said, putting someone back together. Well, maybe I can lend you a hand. I may know something. Let me give you a brief tour of this. Wonderful park of ours. Welcome to the park central square. It's gonna be a trapdoor, isn't there? From here you can access the different districts or balance of fun left or away. Jobs, fun house. Visit amazing stores and have the time of your brief lives in the wacky and wild fun house. Or play some exciting games and then see a performance of the theater. New shows daily, wouldn't you know it? And finally, the big top, where amazing feats of strength are performed by actors of all shapes and kinds. And when you know it, I may have just remembered that something very important may be in there. It could be what you're looking for. But who knows? Right. We'll just take a look and then we'll be on our merry way. Oh, about that. You really thought you could just walk right in here after 20 years and act like you own the place? Which you should? No. You're gonna experience Lampland right down to the very last ticket stub and you're gonna like it. So have fun. Dr. Lumen, it's a long story. I guess the short version of it is, I technically own this theme park. Coming back here is something I hoped I never would have have had to do. Let's hurry. I don't want to stay in this pit of lies any longer than we have to. Lamp land. We're here if you need us, Zero. Can't wait to write all about this place. So you want me to go there first. Two keyholes. Games, shops. Sounds like there's gonna be some difficult mini games up ahead. They said I'm too short to go on any of the rides. Why don't you tell me about them instead? Wait. Huh? Okay, that should not happen. That should definitely not happen. Gonna be encounters here. But they're all boarded up, these shops. Everything here is so expensive. 
one hot dog costs a fortune. They frisked me at the entrance to make sure I didn't bring food. This better be a good... Did it crash? This better be a good hot dog. What place worth a crash? Hey, there's nothing in here. No encounters here. Oh, no. What's the trick here? Push the boxes to make this arrow point downward. We get stuck, stand the light to reset. Yes! I fought outside the box, but there's still some treasure out there, so I don't know. Yeah, let's go back for the treasure real quick. Maybe fight some battles and level up. Defense drink. Hmm. Another puzzle. Red and green boxes can be pushed across the carpet, but yellow ones stay. Okay, but what exactly is my goal here? Typical. Broken door. Hmm. So it's a sliding type. So do I want the green one on there or just the red one? Oh, the red one can move one at a time. That was good enough. Even though I solved it in kind of a scuffed way. A basement? Oh no, I need to keep beat backtrack and make sure I get all the park tickets. They're pink, so they should not be too hard to miss, hopefully. Man, all these electrical enemies are a real pain, huh? Most electrical enemies can be short-circuited with water, but I bet you can bury them with earth too. I can't use magic, so I'll just try throwing some dirt on them. 400G. Miss anything? We should unlock shortcuts too. I'm usually pretty forgiving when things are under repair, but they haven't even put up any detour signs. How do we get out of here? What kind of place is this? How do they expect anyone to get from place to place around here? Petty prizes? Magic Spear? Hmm. So we have to get all the green ones onto the... on the symbols. Wow, they have cooler Crusader toys here. How did this place get that licensing deal? Wow, this park is so lucky to get a merch deal like that. And all the kids here can get awesome Cooler Crusader merch. I'm so jealous. That guy's still alive? What? Oh no. Whoops. There. If I do this, they will have no choice but to all go onto the tiles I want. Well, there's a hamburger in this garbage can. 
Hey, I can get that, I get that reference. That's funny. What a funny video game. It's not a ticket. Even though it looks pinkish. Power gem. Oh man, I have to keep track of both the tickets and the power gem. More shops, but locked. Berry juice. Useless filth. Useless filth. Oh ho, send me the heck up. Be going on here, and there's the ticket. Uh, maybe I can turn in my park tickets here. Doesn't seem like anyone is manning the store. Good, let's get out of here, then. We're storing this lousy park. Now, I wouldn't say that. Or perhaps you just need to see the worth in all this wonderful garbage. Even if it means being the tar out of you until you do. What? Trash Thrasher appeared. They run a trash shop at Lampland, which has brought the, a surprising level of income to the park for some reason. 800 hit points, no weakness or resistances. Okay. Yourself use amp charge to get your buff super high. Defense stance? What? Does that mean I have to use magic on you? Hmm. Oof. Blaze most. Oh, you're weak to fire in this stance. Oh, he took my MP! No. How dare you. Offense stance. Okay. Hunter ice brush. Hmm. Guard break. Here. Rush. I don't know how long these buffs last. No, I should have him use Hunter. Wind. Rush. Defend.
There. Zero advanced to level 14. Perhaps I'm trying to find reason in the impossible. Part key one? This goes to show that people will spend money on anything in this kind of place. I'm gonna guess there's one ticket per area. Hey, if, that, if it makes people happy. Don't you preach to me about making people happy. I wish you'd turn that frown upside down for a change. Free teleportation circle. Anything else here worth looking at? Games District. I'm glad games are free because I spent all my money at the gift store. I've got, I got a kazoo. It's going to be in my drawer of regret. Hey, there's no encounters on this map. Weird. Well, hold there. You don't people look like you're up for a game of Uzi Zapper. Want to give a go? Yes. You got it, Buckaroo. This is your first time. Let's just go over the rules real quick. Like, use the directional keys to move the cursor and pre press Z to shoot your zapper. You have three seconds to shoot down as many Uzis as you can. Regular Uzis are worth one point, gold Uzis free. If you can score 30 or more, there's a fabulous prize. Oh boy. Okay, bub. If you can score 30 points or more, then there's a prize in it for you. It better not be rigged. Oh my, where did I get my cursor go? Time's up, your score is 4 41. A new record. Good job, bub. Here's a little souvenir to prove you spent the day at Lampline like a chump. A chump? Park key two. That's the only price I have, but you can keep going if you want to hit a new high score. Now we play in the training room. Oh, so we thought about port to. Okay, there's probably no more additional prize, right? Okay. Hey, here's the ticket. Is that it for this area? You know, I'm just a few tickets short of winning a, a, the prize of my dreams. Anything we can do to help? Yes, I would be. Just thrilled. Some park goers send a toss their prize tickets if they don't have enough to get anything. I need, oh, about eight of them, if you manage to come across any. Eight? They should be little pink tickets. I only have three, though. Should be out in the open, so don't feel like you need, need to go inspecting every box you see. Oh, and if it helps you, I usually don't see them in places where you can encounter enemies. Anyways, bring eight of them back here to me and I can make it worth your while. So, non-encounter areas are the only places where I can find them. Hmm. Incredible! I see you're just having the time of your life here at Lampland. Are ya? Having a good time? Well, it's... underwhelming, I guess. I mean, half the stores are closed. Yeah, and the whole lamp theme is sort of weak. Now, with all the monsters around, it's kind of hard to have fun. Oh, is that so? They're just... really happy to see you enjoying all the sights. Guy looks so crazy. My job is to make everyone who visits this park happy. And I do it because... You didn't want to. It was never up to me. What I decided to do with my life was is none of your business, nor was it my father's. You never knew what was best for me, and neither do you. Well, if you want my help, you'll just have to see the rest of what you've been missing all these years. Hot off for now. Hope you make it to the big top in one piece. Okay, mister, out with it. This guy's been making this a hassle for us all, and it's clearly because of you. Guess there's no avoiding it. My father was the previous owner of this park. He passed away not long before someone was broken apart. He and I did not see eye to eye. He raised me with the expectation that I would one day own this place. So, what ended up happening? That much should be obvious. I'm, I'm a doctor now. I chose to come aboard the Virtue Road and stay here. In this horrible place. Let's keep going. I want to get this over with as quickly as possible. Another perk ticket. 
That makes four. I wonder if Funhouse is really all that it's cracked up to be. Couldn't hurt to take a look. Oh, hmm. You know what? I bet it's one of those things aimed towards kids and I just feel just just feel embarrassed going in it. Oh, you're lost, son. I'm gonna have the time of my life. I'm working up the courage to give the Funhouse a try. We're after the stomach cramps from this hot dog go there, get the rounds over and done with. Maybe we'll pass on visiting the food court then. A perk ticket. I should probably go give the previous area once over, just in case. Plus, I do kind of need the, uh, to get more skill points, or I mean, stardust. Aha! I knew there was one hiding here. Right behind this counter. Damn, that was tough to see, compared to the other ones. The fun house. You want me to solve puzzles here too? Digital drain. Hmm. Next area is unlocked. Still a combat zone. Your potion. Ball pit. I got stuck in that, uh, that ball pit the other day. It took me three minutes to find my way out of there. It's maybe two feet deep at most. Hey man, not all of us can dive right into the deep end, you know? Some of us need time to learn. We all go at our own pace. The moment you stop comparing yourself to others is the moment you'll eventually you'll realize you can eventually achieve the things you always wanted. Alright, well I didn't need a big spiel about it. It's important you and respect the boundaries and goals you have set for yourself. Hmm. What is this? Only one person at a time. Triangle? Oh, it's a matching game. Triangle. Okay, that's a match. That's a match. No. It didn't reset the old ones, though. That's weird. Strange design choice not to reset the old choices. 
But I guess it makes my life a little easier. Seems like a boss room. Do I have the resources? Wait a minute, weren't you the guy who was t working with Alpha's uh, professor? Greetings. Before you send the Ball Baron. Baron of the greatest ball pit in all of Soma. Hello, Ball Baron. Lampy Larry informed the Baron that some very special guests would be arriving. And it is the Baron's job to provide the greatest form of, of entertainment. Oh, is that so? Indeed it is. But the Baron is feeling quite generous today. If you best the Baron in Fist of Cups, perhaps you shall leave, leave here with more than Larry Burton for. What say you? Let's wrestle. Excellent. How about you? Okay, what's your gimmick? Hmm. Magic break. So that means I won't be able to use physical attacks easily. Almost. Oh no! He can dodge my. S he can dodge magic attacks when I'm blinded. The ball baron is the baron of the ball pit. Ball baron is here to test you. Ball baron hasn't taken vacation time in two years. No weakness or resistance. Okay. Yeah, now we're talking. They almost... Magic Shard... Yourself. They almost... Are you? Hmm. Okay, Zero resisted it, so that's good. He lost his amp. Freeze most. Yourself. Also cure self. Our break. Nasia. Oh ho ho! The Baron is quite pleased with your performance. Heart key free. All those abilities are really mean. All that dazzling and poisoning and... And I'm sure you'd like the Baron to teach you how to use them too. The Baron didn't learn his title just from having this cool hat. The Baron shall impart this knowledge unto you. So that you may also annoy your adversaries. Support skill infused restrict, infused dazzle, and infused poison. It's different from conjures. Does that, does that mean it can stack? 
Now you can go and now you can inflict some fun conditions onto your foes. Big deal. Now don't knock it until you try it, young man. Infused magic will not only inflict status effects, but also power up your friend's magic. These abilities also work on many different foes. Mo even most bosses will have a hard time shrugging these off. Hmm. Infuse restricts. Prevent them from using status effects spells. Dazzle. Re reduce accuracy. Poison. Damage each turn. But we already have something like that. Best of luck to you. The Baron wishes for the rest of your day at Lamp Land to be fun, fun, fun. Okay, there's their teleport back. Theodore. The hero's theater has been short a dancer for a while now. What do you think? Did I apply? Hmm. We got separated from the jungle about 20 years ago, but I've been working part-time here ever since. Wish my friend here would make up their mind about working here, though. I can't pay the bills on my own. The theater is a nice place to relax if you're exhausted of everything else. I actually ran out of stuff to do pretty quickly, though. I don't see any tickets. Oh, here is one. So well hidden. Is there still- there's still one more out there. Welcome to the Beacon Theater. Today's show is going to be a spectacular one. Thing is, some areas have more than one ticket, so it gets really- Oh wait, here it is. Okay, let's go back and turn it in first. Oh, these look marvelous. I can't believe you found eight of them. People don't see the value in these. Time to get what I came here for. Ta-da! It's one of the, those novelty rubber duckies. It even has a lampshade on its head. Oh, and this came with it. You might find a better use for it than I will. Siphon, Sigil. Thanks again. I'll cherish this for about three hours after I get home and then never look at it again. Absorb MP. This is the performer's entrance. Sorry say I can only allow staff members and performers past this point. Let me guess, they're going to want us to perform. Welcome to the Beacon Theater. Are you all excited for today's performance? Hot dog, you bet I am. It'll be fun to sit back and relax for a bit. Okay, kids. The nice, exciting performance will be none other than... Ooh, change of plans, friend the Renos. Well, hello there. I know you were all just dying to watch today's performance. After all, we were going to be handing out park keys to the audience. But, wouldn't you know it, today's dancer called out of work on... A broken leg, let's say. So unless we can find someone to replace them, I'm afraid we'll have just have to hold on to this wonderful key until they recover. Ta-da! Ta-ta! Sorry, folks. Unless we can find another performer, we won't be able to hold today's show. Oh no, is this going to be a rhythm game? Well, I can't dance. I did play the accordion once, but... Where's the performer entrance? Uh, it's to the right as you come in, but... Let's go. Okay. This is the performer's entrance. Sorry to say, I'm here to perform. Uh, okay. Tonight's event is Strike a Pose. Are you ready to perform? How do I strike a pose? You got it. This is your first time performing. Let's me go over to the agenda real quick. When the event begins, a set of moves will appear on the stage. Use the arrow keys and the Z key to input them in the order shown. Complete the combination of Strike a Pose. But if you press the wrong one, you'll have to start a pose again. You'll have three seconds to complete as many poses as you can. If you can score ten or more poses, you'll have a wonderful prize for you. Oh no, this is just like the dueling game from Naufragar. Now then, let's strike a pose. Uh. <sighs> Welcome to the stage. If you can score 10 or more points, we'll have a spectacular prize for you. Ready to begin? Okay, get ready to strike a pose. Ah. Uh. Uh, is that enough? Your score is around 14. A new record. Amazing. I guess it was. Uh, they're saying this, these thresholds pretty... Uh, 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 it's pretty mercifully for us, but does that mean there's a s uh, better price if we go for an even higher score than the threshold? You really killed it out there. Lampy Larry said you could have this if you stole the show. Perky 4. 
Breakfast can now be playing the training room on the Starship Virtue. Advanced and expert difficulties are unlocked. We don't have any more prizes to give, but you're more than welcome to dance for us again. You want to play again? No, you don't have any prizes, so screw it. No point. Well, that's over with. W wow, Lumen. I didn't know you could dance like that. Me neither. Well, I'm super jealous. You picked a few... Uh, if you pick up a few things when your dad owns an amusement park. It's nothing really. Let's just get a move on. What's in here? Hmm. You won't believe this. One of the machines just magically turned itself back on. Wow, just like that, huh? Hey, feel free to give any of the working machines a try. I actually ran out of tokens. Uh, aren't you a... We're all linking a zero. I don't think it needs to be said. Strike a pose. So what's what's the hi higher difficulties like anyways? So these have longer sequences or f shorter times? That's a lot less than before because of the longer uh, uh, sequences, but I still didn't make a mistake, so it's not that bad. Your high score, your score is 12. New record for expert. Okay. Well, no price for, there's no price or threshold, so forget it. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Soma Union. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.